Tuttle, Oklahoma, home of legendary Oklahoma hamburger Brahms, and also Heisman winning quarterback Jason White, according to this water tower. But back to Brahms. What is Brahms? It's just the best burger, fries, and ice cream ever. This is just my opinion, but it's also correct. Brahms is only in five states. Why? Because if the restaurant isn't within about 300 miles of the family farm here in Tuttle, the company can't guarantee its freshness. I think what they're, what they're telling the rest of us is that things can get too big. If you want to make the best ice cream on earth and serve it to as many people as possible, their message is you can only be so big. You get bigger than that, then the quality of your product goes down, and who are you then? Have you ever been ordering a burger and thought, I need groceries? Well, you're in luck at Brom since it's a restaurant and a grocery store. Milk? Got it. Ice cream? Got it. Beef? Shrimp? Toilet paper? Got it. Anything you'll ever need is right here. But why Brahms? What makes it so attractive? And what makes it an Oklahoma staple? Brahms to Oklahoma, people who know with discerning taste when it comes to sort of your drive-through ice cream, burger, shake experience, they know that Brahms is, is the place. You see this cartoon cow bus? You wish it was real? It is at the Brahms Family Farm Tour. People from all over come to the family farm in Tuttle, including this group, the Mandela Washington Fellowship from Africa. Brahms. On the tour, you see where the ice cream is made, you see the milk, you see ice cream cones and breads and hey guy, and it's all made right here. We found this man wearing an In-N-Out shirt in a Brahms and his favorite burger will shock you. In-N-Out. Oh, cut away, cut away. Nathan Poppy loves Brahms so much he got ink of it. Now that's true love. How about this guy, a reporter and food expert who I vetted before this interview to make sure he agrees with me. Everyone thinks their home state has the best hamburger, and here in California, of course, we think In-N-Out is the best burger of them all. We, meaning not me. I think In-N-Out is overrated. I'll explain Brahms for us Californians. Brahms is like you mix Trader Joe's with In-N-Out with Thrifty's ice cream. Brahms is great. And the, the best thing in California, no one knows what the hell Brahms is because we don't know what Oklahoma is except for Troy Aikman used to be there. That's it, Brahms is better. And arguing about the best burger is completely worth our time. Burgers are a great thing to fight over. Uh, and so, yeah, so it it's becomes blood sport. People get emotional about food because they can. And it's partially because of the relationship that they have with food. You get into habits, you get into routines with the way you eat, the certain flavors that, that your mind will demand. And when you hear somebody disputing a, an opinion that is so deeply formed inside of you, it is almost like they, they're criticizing your family. The beauty of it is, it can all be done online now. So what burger do you think is best? Let me know in the comments so I can tell you you're wrong. <laughs>